Hi everyone, this is Matt at Fisher Electronics, and I just wanted to make a quick video here, uh, basically answering the question, what happened to the Fisher Electronics brand? Maybe even have a Sanyo item, but mostly talking about here about Fisher. Um, and the Fisher brand I'm talking about is if I hit logo, that Fisher right there that you see, that common Fisher logo, um, what happened to that brand? We'll get people at times that call us, um, understandably, sometimes they're thinking we're the Fisher Company, and we are not. Um, we're just a, we're a family company. Fisher was in our last name, and we never manufactured anything. We have no relation with this Fisher brand company. Um, but to go over the history of what happened with this Fisher company, uh, the company was formed in 1945 by actually Avery Fisher. Um, and that's why Fisher brand was the name. They just said he went with his last name, Fisher. Um, it was sold to Emerson um, and then to uh, back to Sanyo. When the company formed, it was known as Sanyo Fisher. So if you saw a Sanyo product and a Fisher product, they were manufactured by the same company. Um, so you had Sanyo Fisher... And then 2010 came along and Panasonic bought out the uh, company. They bought out Sanyo, and that included the Fisher name. Well, in 2012, uh, Panasonic basically um, terminated the Sanyo and Fisher brands altogether, and that was really the end of that company. So, unfortunately, all these great products that they made, you know, these big stereos of the old days... Um, those speakers, the speaker systems, you know, those great systems. So a lot of those are still working in people's houses, and they did an excellent job. But that being said, that company that made those, that Fisher company, is gone. They're no longer in existence. Um, you might even see today some Fisher items out there, like a Bluetooth player, a portable speaker system, something that might have the Fisher brand on it. It is not the same company as the Fisher of years ago uh, because that company, as you know, is now bought out by Panasonic and then they, Panasonic terminated them in 2012. So, like right here. Um, well, not there, but um, anything new in Fisher's today's world is not going to be uh, the same company of Fisher. So when you do a search for Fisher Electronics, our company generally will come up because uh, our name is Fisher Electronics, but um, we are not that same company. Um, people call us, and it's understandable. Um, click on our website, and you'll see our website, but we have nothing to do. We don't manufacture anything. We're a whole different company in regards to uh, Fisher Electronics as far as that company is concerned. So the other where you can go to, um, which is pretty accurate, Let's see if I can find it, the Wikipedia page uh, for Fisher Electronics, right here, that, um, and the history here, that gives some good information also as far as, unfortunately, what happened to that company. Um, Alright, just wanted to make that video and keep you up to date and answer your question. You're probably wondering, where, where's this company, what happened to them? Well. Long story short, unfortunately, they're gone. If you have any other comments or like any other videos to be done or suggestions or anything, leave them in the comments section. Thanks for watching, and have a great day.